this is Mary Mattingly with the Big Rapids Pioneer. For this week's Musician Spotlight, we're here at Quinn's Music with Zach Potter. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. Zach plays guitar, bass guitar, and trombone, and he's been working for seven months here as a guitar tech. Thanks again for having us. Um, you're a Big Rapids native, is that right? I am. I've been living here for the past 14 years. Okay. So you're a self-taught musician then? Yeah. Uh, I taught myself guitar when I was around 10 or 11 years old, and around that time I started middle school and I was enrolled in the band program and that got me a good classical music foundation. Okay, so how did classical music training then help you um, explore other styles then? It just really opened my eyes to what else is around me. Uh, when I was younger I wasn't so much aware of you know different symphonies and different styles of music in the classical world. I was more focused on uh, popular music. And so that kind of honed my ear in and gave me a good training. Um, but you mentioned you also went to Gallup School of Guitars. Mm -hmm. So what kind of influenced you to want to learn about the, I guess, the science and the, the skills that go into making and fixing guitars? Uh, you know, it was just something that always kind of intrigued me and how acoustic guitars are built and what makes a good guitar good. And what makes a great guitar, and what separates a great guitar from a good guitar. So you've played a lot in the area then, have you noticed any differences playing for the Big Rapids community versus other communities, or is it all kind of just being able to engage with live audiences everywhere? I've definitely noticed uh, in areas like Kalamazoo where uh, they're more artsy, they tend to react more favorably to jazz tunes and, and blues styles of music. In Big Rapids, um, they tend to react more like country, so it's, it's kind of interesting. You gotta you gotta pay attention to the demographic mm -hmm. of um, who you're playing to. Right. So. so, what do you hope to do with music in the future? Well, I uh, I really enjoy producing musicians and teaching lessons and and coaching younger, more underdeveloped musicians into becoming better. Great. As they progress. Great, so then you obviously have been a musician since you were a young guy and gonna continue doing it. What keeps you playing? Uh, it's kind of a hunger to always become better. I've kind of plateaued over the past few years and I've, I, you know, that, that kind of gets you stuck in a rut and it can be kind of depressing at times. So you gotta always find a way to make things interesting and switch things up. Great. Well, that was everything I wanted to ask. Is there anything you want to add at all? Be sure to check out my band, The Turnips. We're Big Rapids locals. We are gigging, hopefully soon, at Cranker's Brewery in November. And uh, support your local music scene as well. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining yeah, thanks us. Thanks for having me.